Can I ask you a personal question? It is what you do for a living, is it not? Where do you see yourself, say, in ten years' time? That's your personal question. Only because I want the real answer, not what you'd give at a university interview. So you do not mean career? No. What kind of person do you see yourself being? The kind of man I aspire to be. Well, yes. What relevance has that to seeing whether or not there is something wrong with me? It depends on the answer you give and whether you give it. Confidential, right? Whatever you say, only I will hear. What about my diagnosis? We'll get on to that. Do you have an answer for me? I do. Well? In ten years' time, I want to be in charge of everything that's around me. How do you impose on doing that? You imply that it will not happen. Believe me, it will. How do you impose on doing that? By making people fear me. Afraid of what I will do to them. If they went against me in any shape, way or form. Afraid, not only by the way I do things, but also by the way I think. The way you think? To embark fear on people, you just need the right weapon. A weapon that speaks to their fears and insecurities. You intend to have one weapon for each person? Please. You know very well that people's fears and insecurities are not too different. And you just need one weapon to control everyone. That being what? Information. Secrets. What you know. And they're mine. And don't you think people will fight back? Oh, I know they will. People will have something on me from time to time and try to hide it from me until just the right time. For example. For example, what? For example, how you think I didn't notice. You just wrote sociopathy on the diagnosis. Now you're afraid. You know, I have no idea what I will do. You know I can easily kill you. You're afraid of what I will do now that you've decided to go against me. And you know that I know. You know something I want no one else to know.